Here we go. Just making a slight adjustment to the camera. Hey, ladies and gentlemen. We are in the kitchen and we are doing dishes. Because that's part of my job during the day. I thought we could have a little chat. Good morning, Dave. Hey, Jen. Yeah, my name's Ken. Just to give you a heads up. I'm not sure if you knew that. We have Bex. And it's the afternoon there. Yeah, you guys are ahead of us. That's right. What's up, Ken? That's from White Noise. Amsterdam again. Hello from Finland. Hello from the North Pole. Hey, Santa. Sorry, Ken. Autocorrect. I know. I get that all the time. Hi from France. When is the next cook and review? It is going up within the next three hours. It's about quarter to uh, 12 here in Ontario. And uh, you're going to like it. But it's about 27 minutes long. What is on your iPhone sitting? Uh, there's a, a cell phone holder that you'd put in your car. Uh, what's Paul going to cook? Um, Paul is going to cook. I'm just going to turn my uh, phone around so you guys can see. I just don't want to drop my phone into the sink. That would kind of suck. I'm just going to turn the phone around so you guys can see. So I've just got a cell phone holder on my windowsill. And this is what I'm doing right now. And I just put my phone into the cell phone holder. And uh, away we go. And I put it over the sink that doesn't have water in it. <laughs> so the, the one over here has the water in it. one over there doesn't. So just in case it decides to fall off, it'll hit the the sink. No dishwasher. No, we, we live uh, out in the country and we're on a well. Uh, we have a well and we also have a septic system. So the well, between the well and the septic system, uh, it would kill the dishwasher. Plus there's no room. We'd have to lose cabinets. Hey Ken. Who dat? Who dat? <laughs> My dog liked to bark when I said that. Uh, when are you going to come to North Carolina for some food reviews? Uh, someday soon. What are you doing? I'm washing dishes right now. I thought I'd talk to you guys. I think my phone's slowly tipping. That's kind of scary. Are you slowly tipping? It is slowly tipping. I'm like, uh, something's wrong. What's Gun Barrel City? Gun Barrel City, Texas is where I went to videotape a fishing show last year. And uh, the, the town hall, the, the mayor gave us a couple shirts, which is very nice of them. So some of you, some of you know that I uh, work for a fishing, I edit for a fishing, uh, two fishing shows. Uh, one was called um, Extreme Angler and the other one is called Crappy Kings, but and crappy is a type of fish. Uh, hey, Dame Drops is in the house. On the check-in, I just looked up and saw Dame sitting there. What's up, Dame? As you guys know, Dame, uh, the Game Con, and I have started a food con called Crave Con. And uh, I'm hoping that as many of you guys can come out as possible. It is in Galveston, Texas. And uh, we're going to have an absolute blast. But the more people that come out, the better. So if you live in Texas, hey! Uh, it'll be an easier drive than people who live in, you know, New York. Auto chat show. I'll be there. Nice. Make sure you guys were... Oh, and uh, Dave from Sonic Orb Studios is in, might be moving and changing jobs soon. Wow. Send me an email. Let me know what's going on. And Pyro's in the house. Nice. Uh, show me your home, please. Well, I got to do the dishes first. Because if I don't do the dishes, then my wife beats me. <laughs> Sounds like a boat trip from New Orleans. Yes. So I guess you guys, yeah, yeah, you guys can travel by boat from New Orleans over to there. Will do. Thanks, Ken, Dave says. Dame, Damon, back at it again. Damon's never left. He just stopped doing fast food. He's still doing restaurant reviews. And 
I, I never watched uh, Dame for fast food reviews. I watched Dame because it was Dame. And uh, I don't care what he reviews. Well, as long as it's food. <laughs> I, like, I like his food reviews. And, but it doesn't, I don't care what food he reviews because, again, it's not about what he's reviewing. It's about Dame. That's the way I look at it anyway. Uh, wow, lots of comments came in. Uh, it's from the video he did. Oh, cool. Love you, Dame. Do you like soup? Yes. I uh, just got uh, hired to coach my high school track field team. Very cool. Taco Bell US, bring the Cheetos. Yes. Love you, Ken. Well, thank you very much. Uh, must respe uh, much respect to Dame Drops for switching from the fast food game. Definitely lots of respect. Oh, I've got some more dishes to do. Um, just a few more and then we're done and then I can show you the house if you'd like. Uh, my wife doesn't like showing our bedroom so I have to respect that. Also. But, uh, and Ben's room is a mess right now so I can show you where the bedrooms are but I can't show you the bedrooms. I don't want to get in trouble. I like showing you guys stuff but there's only so much I can show you. My phone is slowly tipping over again so I'm going to soak some of these dishes. If you guys want to see a little tour of the house, uh, if you watch my vlogs, my vlog channel is Domic1966. Actually, if you uh, do a Google search for uh, just under Ken Domic, you will. Uh, this super, this periscope is super official. It is. Uh, if you guys want to see more of my house and, and what I do and how I live. Uh, I have a vlog channel. I'm actually on vlog 650, uh, 615, uh, which is absolutely amazing. So if you guys want to see more about my personal life, that's where you go to see it. Uh, or you can just, uh, Dominic vlogs are great. Well, thank you very much, Dave. All right, let's do a little uh, how. So this is our laundry room and storage. We live in a 900 square foot bungalow, so it is small. And, uh, but I'm working on that. We're going to hopefully, that's where I keep all my hats. As you guys know, I collect hats. Uh, usually when I go to do football games with the boys, there's my Heisenberg hat. That's where I store it at the moment. And that's the other pile of hats right there. And my juicer. Uh, and then going back this way, we have the kitty poopy area. And that's our furnace is right there. We have this little divider thing that we can put across here when we have company over. Uh, we buy bottled water because we live in a well system and we don't really trust the well water. It's probably totally fine, but uh, here's a pan of the kitchen. Do, do, do. Oh, there's Ninja. Ninja wants to say hello. And there's our backyard. Uh, it is like 15 degrees uh, Celsius here in Ontario or in this area of Ontario and uh, so which is about almost 60 degrees which is awesome uh, so we just got the new stove we just got the new fridge we've already loaded it up with our magnets uh, and that's <laughs> it's funny we have these chairs but we rarely ever use them nobody ever actually sits there uh, we used to a long time ago but uh, we don't anymore so I use this chair right here for when I do my my cycling in the kitchen uh, there's Sam Sam say hello when are you gonna come to Australia someday there's my my TV that I saved up and I uh, got it took me a long time to find that kind of a, um, a TV stand with cabinets and stuff and as some of you guys know from my blog channel this is my workstation there's Sunny Yes, we have a lot of animals. She's a calico cat. Uh, so this is my work area. I call that my light beer right there. Nice. Molson Canadian light beer. Water. <laughs> uh, so I just finished doing the cook and review. Where's Louie? I think he's upstairs in Megan's room. Uh, so right now I'm compressing uh, today's cook and review. This is the, I use Final Cut Pro 7. And as you can see, this is, that was some of the cooking that we did. And that's Paul and I doing the review, shaking hands at the very end. Now can we give you a little hint? Paul, for showing us how to create this amazing Caesar salad. 
So we did the Caesar salad and the habanero hamburgers, habanero sauce hamburgers. So I use uh, the Mac. That's my Macintosh computer. That's my storage uh, thing. It's uh, called a Drobo. It has probably about, I don't know, 20 terabytes worth of space. Uh, there's my sign that uh, Pyro made me, Travis. Uh, I'm right now trying to figure out how to sell all my very old camera gear. That's a, a, a Canon Mark, Canon 5D Mark II. I want to sell that. I got a 50 mil lens. I've got this lens here. I'm trying to sell that stuff off, and I uh, don't know how much to ask for yet. That's looking out my front window. I get to see that every day. My wife puts decals on our window for winter time. Ash wants to buy your camera, Ken. Nice. I've got a buyer. So that's our dining room table. We usually just pull that out into the thing so we can all sit around it. Uh, again, we're short on space. I'm just backing up so you guys can see. There's my new chair. I love my chair. And uh, one of the main reasons I got the TV and the chair and the couch is because I had to stop sitting there for 16 hours a day because I'd sit there all day, work, and at nighttime I'd sit there and watch movies on my computer. So that's why I went out and bought a chair to get myself away from that. Uh, couch with the kitty condo thingy. Uh, and that's an old chair. And then, of course, I'll our TV. So let's go over here. So that's... Carol's in my bedroom. Megan's bedroom is upstairs. There's our fish. I have to clean out the tank still. That's Jenny. Uh, there's the washroom. Oh, Louie was just here. He went upstairs. Oh, you missed him. And that's Ben's room. And Ben has a python. I'm not sure if you can see him. Let me turn the light on. There he goes. He's a ball python. Look at the heart's pounding out. He's about three feet long. And uh, it's time for feeding very soon. We could do a review. What do you feed it? We feed them dead rats. So you can buy rats at the uh, store. There, the camera's turned around. Nice snake. Well, thank you. Uh, it used to be Paul's middle kids, and he just got bored of it and didn't want it anymore. Um, he wasn't feeding it, and not that he wasn't, he, wa he, he was just letting his dad feed it. It wasn't like they weren't feeding it, uh, so he just completely lost interest in, and didn't want it anymore. Um, we feed him probably every two weeks, maybe, maybe three weeks. Some people feed them like every week. Uh, a rat costs about four bucks, and they're about about that long, maybe about nine inches long from head to to butt and uh you have to put them in a like a gladi bag put them in lukewarm water to get them to thaw and then you have to put them in hot water to get his body temperature up so that the snake can zero in on them and then you just dangle it in the in the uh, uh, ca uh cage or aquarium uh is J is megan enjoying her tablet thing yes she's using it all the time creating artwork and stuff so i had 33 people hang out this whole time which is absolutely fantastic hope you're well buddy from ash hey ash all right guys uh thanks for stopping by keeping me company while i did the dishes i gotta go finish up the big pots and pans uh oh muskoka bearware is in the house sorry i'm not wearing a shirt today i have to change it up get it washed you know what i'm saying anyway guys thanks for stopping by uh i love all the questions you guys give me and uh i hope you enjoyed the tour of the house house tour and this will be going up on my periscope channel which is kbd periscope tv i always put all my periscopes up there for people who miss the show the live show and they also miss the 24 hour period in which it sits up on periscope and then disappears so i always put them all up uh it's all good ken well thank you uh without the text that's the only problem but you know auto chat show see when i shout you guys out at least that's still in the video anyway thanks a lot guys for stopping by thanks for uh, keeping supporting all my channels i really appreciate it and we'll talk to you guys real soon bye